Hi everybody, welcome back to my channel, Melt with Nat and Jack. I'm Natalie. If it's your first time here, welcome. If you're returning, thank you so much. Welcome back. I did my Ava's video last night and I said that I would follow it with a video that I was doing a beach themed basket for my really good friend at work. It's her 40th and we're celebrating it tomorrow. I didn't get to do the basket last night. I think I said twice in my video, I was just so exhausted yesterday and I still am just like exhausted. But, um, so I wanted to do this video and show you guys how I do my baskets because I like to do baskets for people for special occasions, for birthdays. And so most of the time it's a theme. So she loves the beach. We live at the beach. We all love the beach here. So I'm um, going to share how I do this basket with you. I started to prepare it or else this would have been hours because I take a long time and thought process of how to put things together, or what looks best. So let's get started. So this basket I got at Home Goods. And it was, I cut the price tag off, $14.99 at Home Goods. And I'm doing it a beach theme with a couple of other things in it. So I got her um, on Amazon this beach dish towel for her kitchen that says the beach is my happy place with seashells on it. And it was $5 on Amazon. So this I have in it. Then I'm doing, I had said last night, her mom just passed away. We had the funeral Tuesday. So I saw this yesterday at uh, Burlington. I ran into Burlington like to grab like little other things for her. And um, so I got her this notebook pad that says yesterday is heavy, put it down. Um, and it's just like, a, I don't even know. I didn't really open it. I just like the saying on it for her. Yeah, it's just like a daily thing to write things, like to write things in. So I just thought this was really good to give her right now. So I loved this book. So I have this in there. Then I'm giving her a beach warmer and I'll show you which warmer it is because I have it myself. And it's our starfish warmer. It's the watering can. I'm gonna put it back in. Put, I'm gonna put things back in how I'm taking them out. So I wanna show you how I wrap it. Then I got her Boardwalk Taffy Shower Gel and Body Lotion from Bath and Body Works. And yes, Sensi has this stuff too, but I actually like Bath and Body Works better. I'm always honest. Um, then I'm giving her um, counter cleaner in Blue Grotto. I know she'll like that, the Blue Grotto. And I'm giving her the bathroom cleaner in, which one did I pick? Is it aloe? Aloe water and cucumber bathroom cleaner. So Blue Grotto counter cleaner, aloe water and cucumber bathroom cleaner. I'm giving her the berry waffle cone um, candle, which is my favorite one. And then I threw in there an L3. It says um, um, Amaretta Pina Colada birthday cake. So I have this sitting in here. Um, then I'm doing four Scentsy bars, like all beachy ones. Uh, palm trees and ocean breeze. Coastal sunset. Bonfire beach. Sand Swept, and Scarlet Sunflower. So I'm gonna put these back in. Then a birdhouse for her to hang in her backyard. Has the holder on it. And I got this at Home Goods. I don't even know what the price of this is. The price, the price isn't even, oh, it is. It was 
I'm happy I looked at the price because now I could take the price. I thought I had the price tag off on everything. I'm gonna, I want to wrap it on here so I don't want to keep this on here. That was cheap, right? $7.99. That's a good price. Okay, I got the price off of there. Maybe should take the whole thing off if I can. Sorry. I tried to do all this before I started, but I slipped on this one. Okay. Then, okay, so she loves these Utz pretzels, the honey wheat ones. Because I keep them at my desk and I keep the big one at my desk. And um, I now work from home. But when, I mean, for six, we worked together 16 years. And we both started at the same time, me and Michelle. And um, I, she's downstairs, I'm upstairs. And she'd come upstairs and run back by me and go, I'm not here to talk to you. I'm just here to take your pretzels. I'm like, okay. And I, always, I get the big one at Costco of them. So I'm throwing these in there with salsa. And then I got these chips, but I can't fit them in the basket, so I'm just going to walk in with them tomorrow for her. And they are, and I got these at Home Goods in their um, gourmet food department. They're hummus and garden bell pepper tortilla chips. So those I'm just going to walk in freely with. And now I'll show you how I wrap it. So the beach towel I had like that, the book, all of that. So then I get off of Amazon, I always get their big roll of the cellophane, and then this opens up wide, like it's it opens up. So it's perfect for baskets. So I already have it opened, and then I seal it. Move it over a little bit. And I had a twist tie here. Where did the twist tie go? I had a twist tie. Now I don't have a twist tie. I always twist tie it, but I'm not seeing. I had it here with my ribbon. Ay, ay, ay. It must have fallen somewhere when I was moving things around. Oh, no, I got it. So then I take like a twist tie. I always save twist ties to things because I even use them outside in my garden. Like if something's falling over, I just get the twist ties. Um, okay, let's do this right now. Let me get your head together. So I take the four corners the best I can. I spread it out so that it covers the whole thing and then you'll see how I tape it. Okay. I think that's gonna do it and then I'll fix it up after it's twist tied. Okay, then I take my scotch tape and I take the sides where it's open. And I like as if you're wrapping a gift. I don't like to use too much tape, so I try to get it perfect so that I'm not using that much tape.
Okay, so now this side is fully covered. Now I'm gonna do the other side. Okay, perfect. So then I cut my ribbons already. So I did a black ribbon. I did, a, but her favorite color is blue. So I did a blue ribbon. And then I did a purple. Oh, I didn't show you guys the confetti that's inside. I do confetti on the bottom. And I did purple and white confetti. And the confetti, the confetti is the confetti when we get our wax hauls. When they put confetti in our boxes, I have a crate in my craft area. I have a closet that I keep all my craft stuff in. And I have a crate and I go and I dump it into the crate and I never buy confetti. I always just use the vendor's confetti they send. And um, for this one, I did purple and white on the bottom. I wanted to show you guys, but too late now. But it's purple and white confetti and I didn't pay for it. All right, so then I'm going to tie on it, if I can lift it up, a Bonfire Beach Car Bar. I know she'll like that. And then my one of my girls at the office called and she's like, um, we wanna know what, what, what summer wax, I have, there's 13 of us there. What summer wax you got at the house? Everybody needs summer wax. So I had to pack up another box with all the summer wax that I have in stock for them so yeah it's a little crazy um all right then the blue i don't know if i'm gonna do the pink on it definitely want to get the blue on there because that's her favorite color she is so not a pink person she is not pink okay i'm gonna skip the pink i'm gonna do it like this okay there we go so that's how I tie the Bonfire Beach car bar and I tie it around the rim into a bow. And this is my summer themed beach basket. And she's going to love it. Then everybody makes something. And for the longest time, everybody, my guy friends, my girlfriends, my kids' friends are all like, you need to do your cooking videos. So I'm like, yeah, like I have time for that. But to, we all, everybody brings food in, like whatever that person really likes. Michelle loves for 16 years. I make for her not only on her birthday, I make it and bring it into the office. I do an avocado, tomato, cucumber, and fresh provolone reggiano cheese with garlic and red onion. So I went to Costco yesterday. I got six cucumbers, a bag of avocados, and they're perfect, like just perfect to cut them up in the morning. I got the tomatoes on the vine. I got a block of the Parmesan Reggiano cheese. So tomorrow morning, I'm gonna get up early, wash it all, put it all in a bowl. I add fresh garlic, chopped red onion, and I do a tarragon dressing with extra virgin olive oil, tarragon vinegar, a little salt, a little Italian seasoning, a little oregano, mix it up. Then I take a bunch and I put it separate for Michelle to bring home so she don't have to share it with anybody a big bowl out for everybody at the office. And then I stop on my way at Joe Leone's, which is our big Italian place down here. And I go pick up their, I'm gonna call them in the morning to put two loaves aside of their fresh brick oven bread and you buy it and it's hot semolina bread they make. So I'll get two loaves of that. Somebody's making the buffalo chicken dip in the crock pot. Somebody's bringing in bagels with spreads. And then when it's your birthday, you get to pick wherever you want. To, or, on top of all that, we still order lunch. 
because Mike that owns our company, whenever it's someone's, well, he buys lunch every Friday anyway. I'm not there anymore. I'm at, I work from home most of the time, but every Friday he buys the whole office lunch, but whoever's the birthday person, they get to pick where, whatever they want to eat. So it'll be a big food fest and I'm spending the whole day there tomorrow with my girls from early in the morning till Semper's vet appointment at three o'clock, which is right across the street from my office. And I'm excited because I love seeing my girls. Um, we were just all together Monday and Tuesday for Michelle's mom's wake and then the church funeral Tuesday. So to be together in a good light and make her day super nice. I'm really excited to do that for her. She is not on YouTube, so I don't have to worry about her watching this. Um, she'll tell me you are friggin' crazy that you do the that you're on YouTube, but anyway, she thinks I'm crazy anyway. But okay, guys, I hope you enjoyed my video. I wanted to do this because I talked about it in my Ava's video last night that I was going to do this beach theme uh, basket. And um, I hope you guys enjoyed it. Thank you so much. God bless. I love you guys. Thank you so much. Good night. I'll see you this weekend with my empties. Yeah, with my empties. Good night, guys. Thank you.